Um, the next thing is, guys, God dang it, for the life of God, stop posting that you got vaccinated on social media. Oh, my God. Oh, dude, stop doing that. You don't want to I got my... <laughs> I got my vaccinated. I got, I'm not vaccinated. And then, like, covering your name or your number. What? Don't, don't, don't even do it. Think of it this way: Did you ever get the um, vaccination for chicken pops, uh, Hep B, and all that crap? Did you post about? <laughs> do you want to go back and post about that on social media too? Don't post it because. Thieves, even if you cover up your name or your birth date or whatever, whatever, thieves can can use the internet to pace and puzzle together your information just by you posting that. So don't post that you were vaccinated online. Let that be your little secret. You can keep some secrets. I know you're excited, but if you've already posted, go back and delete it. You know, you know why? Here's why. We have no idea what's gonna happen in the future. We have no idea what they're going to use this for. And then here's your proof that you've been vaccinated. That's great that you posted it online. However, that is still a medical record. And you do not ever want your medical information out there. We're all getting older. And you know how the United States and insurance companies work, right? Insurance companies will never want to pay out for anything. So it could be in five years, you know, oh, you were vaccinated. Oh, by this vaccine. Oh, we're going to use that to deny your claim because we don't accept blah, 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 blah. But, you know, so don't keep it quiet until you need to bring it out, okay? If you, again, if you posted it online that you were vaccinated, you got your old Fauci, Fauci, honey, get on over there and delete it. Delete it, delete it, delete it. That is a very, very smart tip from Go uh, Katrina Matthews here.